Hello everyone! Welcome, welcome to another video here on this channel. I know we have been absent for a while. We haven't had time to post. We've been very busy. With life. With life. That got in the way. Yeah, so, so today we decided to come out here to a beautiful state park called Petit Jean. So what is there to do here? You that you do more research on <laughs> stuff like this. Okay, it's our first time here, but there's a lot of trails you can hike. There's a restaurant. There's a lot of cabins so you can stay the night. And then there's two pools, but they're closed right now. Okay. Because it's the fall. So, yeah. So yeah, it's fall time right now. Yeah. It's a little chilly, but it's beautiful. Right now we're gonna hike a uh, Cedar Fall Trail, right? Yeah, Cedar Fall Trail. It's a two-mile hike, I think. And yeah, I think I, there's an overlook somewhere over there. I heard that it's an easy, it's an easy hike. Yeah. So we're gonna do that, and then uh, we're gonna eat here because they have a restaurant. Thankfully, we thought that there was gonna be any food, but uh, or it was gonna that it was gonna be closed, but it's actually open, and they close until nine. So we have plenty of time to do stuff and still get something warm to eat. And as always, we brought along my brother Jaden with us again today. He's part of this of this channel already. So today, like I said, we are gonna explore this beautiful park when we came in here when we were coming in we stopped by the entrance and there are a couple of overlooks and they look really beautiful yeah so and this uh, is actually a pretty big park Alex. is it there's about there's like eight or nine trails in total oh wow we're gonna do this one right now because i think it's the most popular one and there should be a really beautiful waterfall at the end so let's go right I said it was going to be an easy trail and look, already finding cliffs. Yeah, I don't think I brought the right shoes. Nobody. I didn't bring mine either. I didn't brought white shoes. <laughs> That's even worse. <laughs> We're supposed to have a nice day today here. Cloud, partly cloudy. It's been overcast all the way pretty much to here. I had to drive like two and a half hours to get here. I can hear a lot of water around here. There's a stream right there. There's another one right there. I mean, it's the same one, but wow. Yeah, I think we came here in a, on a good day after a rainfall. Oh, it's beautiful. And it's a nice fall day. The scenery and the foliage coming here was really pretty. Wow, it's all the way down. Who lied on the internet and said this was an easy trail? Liars out there, man. Uh -huh. Watch your step, Jaden. And you too. And me too. Let me know if you need help. Give me the scarf here. I'll take it. By the way, if the audio sounds a little weird, it's because I forgot my actual microphone at the house. So I'm just recording with the camera audio. Uh -huh. Oh, the sun is coming out. Nice. No, I said the sun is coming out. It's just like, it's already out. I want to take a picture of this little waterfall. Wow, so pretty. Yeah, follow the the markers. They place markers along the trail to be able to follow it easier. Wow. Such a beautiful day. It was cold in the morning, but it's getting better now. Yeah, that's why it's good to dress up in layers. Because when it's cold, you put something on. When it's, uh, when it's hot, you take something off.
So give us an update on the trail. What do you think? Like what's your experience on this trail so far? You think it's difficult? What do you think about it? I think it's... I don't think it's hard. You don't think it's a difficult trail? No, it's just really rocky. Yeah. So I think you should wear the right shoes because like these... Yeah, don't come here, don't come here with tennis shoes like that. Yeah. Learn like from it. rookies mistakes. Because those are more rough. Yeah, or white shoes. Oh yeah. Like someone over there. Because <laughs> it's muddy. Yeah, but so... Other than it being rocky, I think it's good. When How much? Up the trail, it's gonna be a little hard because it's. Yeah, going down is is easy, but going up, since you're going uphill, it's yeah, gonna be harder. Yeah. So, um, where are we on the map? I don't know. Are we almost there? Uh, look. So we started like right there, and then I don't know where this is. Okay, so I we're about to cross a bridge. So Can maybe, you see the bridge yes. there? This one right here. Okay. Right there. So we don't have a lot left. And then there is the... Wait. The Mather Lodge. That's the dot oh, right there. Oh, actually we do have quite a way. Okay. All and right. then there's the Cedar Fall, Falls Overlook. Okay, let's keep going then. I don't know if that was some focus, but I'm still going to put it there. But the leaves are turning and falling. Although here, there are a lot, of more, a lot more greens than over there in yeah. Northwest Arkansas. Those rock formations look pretty, pretty cool too. Look at that little canyon right there. That looks nice. I'm gonna take a photo with my other lens. Not right now. Um, Capacity 25 people. Oh, nice. Still here, walking to the waterfall. It is pretty far. It is a two-mile hike, and it's pretty rocky as well. So it's uh, fairly difficult, in my opinion. Kenny doesn't think it is, but I think it, especially on the way back, I think it is going to be more difficult than coming back down. But uh, the good thing about it is that you do walk along this really pretty stream most of the trail once you get to the bridge, and. Uh, it makes a really beautiful scenery, especially today. The sun finally decided to come out and it's making things even prettier. So, so far, I am really enjoying this hike. <laughs> In fact, I'm going so slow that they already left me behind. So I have to catch up to them. Um, it is a little muddy today because it has been raining lately here, I think. I don't know if you can see it there. But other than that, it's really nice, really pretty. Probably gonna spend here the whole day today and uh, explore the rest of the park. So what do you think of the waterfall? I like it. There's a lot more water than I thought. I think it's because of the rain yesterday. You know what I like in here? What? The droplets of water. <laughs> yeah. A lot of little droplets. It looks nice. This thing is huge. And then the trees are there. It's yellow. Yeah, we came here at the per perfect time, I think. Fall. Everything looks really pretty. It's gonna get an awesome picture there. 
All right, so right now we're gonna head back to the mother lodge and uh, we're gonna grab some food there because we are starving. I don't know about you, but I'm really hungry. I am hungry, but look, it's already 1.20. Yeah. The time is like flying. It's gonna take us about an hour to get back, no? All right, we are heading back out to the park and uh, I gotta say goodbye to this waterfall, this really pretty waterfall. This has been a pretty good workout so far. I'm like super sweaty and it's a really good hike, highly recommend it if anybody can do it and they want to come to Pettigene State Park this is a highly recommended hike it is fairly difficult unlike they were saying on the internet or my, I might have read something that wasn't something that was wrong, fake news but uh, from what I can remember someone said that this was a really easy accessible hike but I think they meant the other overlook to this uh, waterfall. So we're almost to the top here. And we can't wait to take all these things off and make it to the car and go eat because I'm starving. We are done with our lunch. How was it? Good. I like the catfish and the hush puppies and the mashed potatoes. Yeah. What about you? Did you like what you got? Yeah. It was really good. I got the same thing and I actually really liked it. All right. So now let's go explore the park a little more in the car. Maybe we can do a little walk, but not like a hike again. Let's go. Vamos. Bro, you have to walk right now. Come on, let's go. So after eating lunch, we decided to continue to explore the park. So we drove down the road to Cedar Falls Overlook, which this is actually the easy trail that I read about online. After a quick walk to the Cedar Falls Overlook, we proceeded to the visitor center where we went and learned a little bit more about the history of Pettigene. And here is where we also found out about the legend behind the name Pettigene, which translated from its original French language means Little John. See the curve in that river's bed. After leaving the visitor center, we drove down to Stout Point which is a lookout with an amazing view of the valley below. After about 30 minutes of enjoying the amazing views that could be experienced from Stouts Point, we decided to drive back to the entrance of the park to enjoy the sunset at Petit Jean before ending our day and finally going home. All right, so this is the end to our trip to Petit Jean State Park. So what do you guys think about it? It was good. You didn't like it? Okay. What about you? I liked it too. Yeah, the trail to the waterfall was kind of difficult. And I'm yeah. glad we actually did that as soon as we got here. Because we got that over with. Uh, I'm not complaining. It was actually really pretty. And I would definitely do it again if I come here another time. But it did take, a, it did take us quite a while. To Probably do. two hours. Like two, yeah, two hours. I think um, I would like to come back here again another time. Today when we got here it was kind of overcast. It was kind of cold, and yeah. we thought it wasn't gonna it wasn't gonna be a good day because uh, it was gonna be too cold. But it actually turned out to be a really nice day. You can right now you can't even see a cloud in the sky, so it's nice. Um, but yeah, we're gonna end this video here. We're gonna head back home now. So thank you for watching. I know we haven't posted any channel in a while, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did. Uh, leave a like and leave a comment if you want. So thank you and we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye.